Our mob is a, an exhibition which is a statewide celebration of Indigenous art from all over South Australia, uh, both regional and remote Indigenous artists. It's held annually as part of the Sala Festival at the Art Space Gallery and the Festival Theatre Foyer. Over 80 artists are involved with almost 100 works of art across a variety of mediums, including weaving, painting, uh, drawing, ceramics, and even a bark canoe. This canoe is a fantastic uh, contemporary uh, cultural, it's, it's like living culture. It was cut down from a red gum tree uh, in Kalangadu in the state southeast by Major Sumner, a Nalanjeri elder. As far as he knows, this practice hasn't occurred uh, in the state for maybe a hundred years. Um, and he wanted to keep his people's culture alive. So he really very much wanted to exhibit as part of our mob. So what I love about this is that it, it enlivens the space and it helps visitors engage with the diversity of Indigenous art uh, and culture because they can't be separated. This year we have a uh, focus on Nalanjeri culture and we have a feature wall of Nalanjeri works. These works are by Nalanjeri artist Eileen McHughes, who's working in traditional techniques and forms, but also looking at more contemporary interpretations of what's possible with object making. These are related works um, by Nalanjeri artists of Camp Kurong, past Meningi, and they're um, using traditional Nalanjeri weaving techniques in terms of fishnets, but taking it a little bit further in terms of creating a whole garment. There's a fantastic diversity um, in the Armob exhibition of works by artists from all over the state. People from Port Piri, Port Lincoln, um, Sejuna, Port Adelaide uh, and the APY lands. It's great to see um, artists entering works in a variety of mediums. This year uh, we have uh, a number of ceramic works which is fantastic to see that people are thinking beyond painting and what I love about these is that she has titled them um, in her language so this is uh, Gulda or Gulda otherwise known as a lizard and so it's it's a subtle way to perpetuate and celebrate her culture and her language and the survival of that. Uh, each year our mob incorporates uh, our young mob which is uh, open to any uh, young indigenous artists under the age of 18. This is a group work from the APY lands um, by a group of young uh, artists from Tungapalia. This year a feature of our mob is the Adelaide Festival Centre inaugural Acquisitive Indigenous Art Award. And the winner is this work by Beaver Lennon from Sejuna Arts and Culture. When I first saw this work, it absolutely took my breath away. I love uh, the sense of light, uh, the way you can almost hear the sounds of the break of dawn, uh, the, the very particular detail in the species that are depicted. And it's of Beaver's uh, very particular country of the meaning people in the far west uh, coast area of South Australia. So he's painting his country um, but in, in a way that's different from some other Indigenous painters. In the short time that our mob's been open, there's been a fantastic response to the exhibition. We've had really strong visitor numbers and several of the works have sold, so that's fantastic.